this is Cyber Sorcerer, and welcome to PC Tech Help on YouTube. This is my first video, an introduction video. I'm using Camtasia Studio to record these. Um, what I'm going to be doing here is basically covering security related issues. Uh, what I do professionally is a malware researcher. I reverse engineer malware, uh, find vulnerabilities in Microsoft patches or vulnerabilities in software, and publish those on the internet. Or um, sometimes sell them to certain companies that purchase them. Being a freelancer, I don't work for a company or anything, so I gotta make money every once in a while to support myself. And there's some companies that pay good money for well known vulnerabilities in like Internet Explorer or any kind of software platform that's used uh, widely enough, like uh, Microsoft Office or something like that, where there's millions of people that use it. But anyway, that's another topic. We'll get to that. Uh, later on down the road. Right now we're going to be covering, well my first set of videos is going to be covering IRC or Internet Relay Chat and uh, the program of choice is going to be Merck. This here, um, since I do security research I frequent a lot of questionable IRC servers and um, talk to questionable people so I get attacked a lot and stuff. I'm also an IRC operator on uh, one network. It's an ad adult IRC network and um, so this here is a very very customized version of Merck. Uh, I'll give you a quick run through. You can see on here on the toolbar, let me zoom in on that. You can see up here on the toolbar that I got my name up there, Cyber Sorcerer, and that's because this is a custom menu. Uh, my capturing software is messing with my refresh rate. But you can see and these are all scripts that have been programmed in here. You can see an IRC op manager. And if I was to click on that, you can see the IRC control panel here. And uh, it's got the server admin, op server, user actions, message IRC op, stats server, pretty much everything on here. I'm going to go ahead and close that. And zoom back out of here. And you can tell that I'm on a Windows Vista machine by the way. So my recording software is really slowing down Vista. But uh, anyway, if you wanted to look at my... Here's the scripts. For those of you that get scripting, this allows, allows you to have those custom um, windows you just saw. Got the pop-up window. Got the remote window user window, variables. We'll be covering all this. You, you can see all the stuff that's in here. Having something like this requires, you know, this many scripts that I have. I mean, this is, handles people trying to attack you, trying to send viruses to you through DCC, all kinds of, anytime somebody tries to contact your computer or tries to contact you through IRC, uh, this program that I have here, which is uh, built by 2448 and also heavily customized by me, as you can tell from the cyber source, I put my own little menu up, item up there, but um, which has been further enhanced by me with my own little quirks, is uh, anytime someone tries to contact you, this here will let you know uh, pretty vanvalently. You won't be able to miss it. Even if you're, you got it minimized or surfing or something, uh, as long as Merck is connected to the IRC channel, anytime someone tries to do something, even ping you. If, if I wanted to let me know every time someone pinged me, I mean, it, it, I could set it to do that. It all depends on how um, how much information that I want to know. Let me see if I can get someone uh, to PM me here. Maybe I'll give you a little, little example. Um, how about... How about DJ Zeth? Maybe he... Uh, PME. It is really going slow. Well, you know, Vista has its issues. I'm sure you all know that. So we'll see if... Uh, See if he will 
contact me here through PM. I don't know how busy he is. He's doing a live show right now on Ustream.tv. Um, I have my own channel on there also. It's uh, Cyber Sorcerer, of course. And you can see, there he is. You can see right here, query request from DJ. It tells you the address, everything. You just click accept. Let me thank him for that. He's one of the uh, network administrators for irc.warpradio.com uh, on here. I also have a channel on here that's IRC Help. I handle all the help for anyone that needs uh, help with IRC or anything like that. And you see it also puts a notice here in my window. As a further notice, let me know what happened when I'm in the main window where I'm chatting and what window it come from since I was in warp. You can see queried with IRC chat waiting for acknowledgement and that goes into my logs along with a lot of other stuff. This uh, this here is just the, cert, the IRC tells me that he was from warp radio. He's on a warp radio server. You get on the bigger IRC networks they have larger servers. But anyway we'll cover all this and more the programming and how to customize Merc even further. You can see I got custom toolbars up here. My skin, this here at the top of the Merc has been skinned. And we'll cover that also. But um Hope you guys enjoy the series on IRC chat and scripting with Merc and further customizing it. And uh, hope to help everybody out there be a little bit safer in IRC. If you have any questions, you can come over to the by Ustream channel at ustream.tv slash channels slash cyber sorcerer. I have my live broadcast over there, and you're welcome to join in over there and ask questions or anything. Or you can come to warpradio.com and go into the IRC help channel, and I'll be glad to help you with your Merc issues or scripting or whatever other security-related problems you have. All right. Thanks, everyone, for joining, and I hope to see you, and we can get started.